out, so it doesn't seem like he will be too surprised. Wildcard with the 4 for 1 split on heroes right now for runes. Oh, he's still getting caught out. He was not aware. He was just guessing yeah. anything, just barely. Well, he's got the swash. the swash to get away, so he's fine. Leslau, however. Oh boy, that is first blood. <laughs> Did I pick him for least death? Oh no, I, I picked, picked you, you Thank God. <laughs> Jesus. That is a good first blush. Onto Alex, but looks to be fine. Quinn gets He's haste. Give each other high fives and go the back to the jungle. On Lash. Yep, it's a good one. He's gonna pop it, and they want to try to fight. Sammy boy. No dragon tail. There's the slowdown with the lightning storm, so that's gonna set up a split earth. That's an easy kill alone. Now he's in trouble. He's gonna get the heavenly jump off. It's Vi Lama. Gets off the shield crash, looking for the ult as well. Alone knows that he's likely to die, and he does. Uses the Thunder God's Wrath, but no kills to come for Wildcard other than the Undying in the top lane, which wasn't even a part of this fight. But there's the initiation from Yawar getting off that Storm Bolt. They find themselves another kill onto Divai Lama, second of the game. 150 CS, minute 15. Troll has 100. I, the disparity yeah. between these carries is enormous at this point. I know it's only 1300 net worth, but Troll and Sven, both with a free game, will sometimes generally go hand in hand if Troll oh, gets a fast Alex game, but... tried to get the dispose, but just yeah. a little bit out of range for him. And that's going to cost him again, so. Yeah, Sonics just feel like they're getting everything that they want and not a whole lot of pressure from Wildcard. They've tried to pull off some smoke ganks, but they've all failed thus far. I mean, this is shaping up to potentially be one of the biggest stomps of the tournament at this raid. Yep, Sammy Boy's just dead to the three right oh clicks. Divai Lama death number five. Oh, 05 and zero, and now they likely will go to the Roche Pit. There's a DD still with the God Strength activated. Yep. And Quinn actually getting close to finishing an Eternal Shroud. And my Llama see that is going to jump MSS. A great item for Lesh is Divai. Are they actually going to try to fight this? The Tombstone's Tombstone. down already. So Sammy Boy is just going to fall right off the bat. Still with the Aegis in tow. Is a nice Terrorize applied to alone. That's going to lead to an easy kill on him. My Llama gets a nice Shield Crash. But again, does not lead to a kill for Wildcard. They're getting shellacked. The life steal online. Interesting that he didn't activate it there when they went for that jump. He's holding on to it. Maybe waiting for his second life to use it. Yeah, I guess. I mean, uh, it, uh, he also might have thought they were just trying to poke and bait, you know, and weren't really going to. There's the oh, dragon from Leslau initiation. Easy kill, no save from Alex. He does have his shard, so he tried for the rebound play, but he dies too in the end. That means high ground for Sonics. 36 seconds on the Aegis. Dude, this feels like Man, one of Sonic's games value. from the beginning of the tournament. Yeah, that is true. Completely annihilating their opponents in this game. There's just nothing for Wildcard to show in this game. Their lanes went okay for a while, but with the exception of top, of course. But without, Seven. They do KAD, right? Yeah, oh, nice blink from Devai. That was clutch. He will survive here. And he's got the shard now, so that is going to help him out a bit. Uh, Sam Sammy has Boy, been here before. He takes the outpost for about uh, five seconds. Yeah. Dies Did for it, of course. Not get any value out of that. Didn't get it at the minute count, so <laughs> doesn't yeah. really make a difference. And, a wild card. Yeah. They want to fight. Four of them are smoked. Leslau is going to show. Rolling Can thunder. They're there gonna it try. is to start things out. They're going to use it with the roll-up and the BKB activated from Eden and the ult as well. They're going to take out the DK and now Yawar in a bit of trouble. He's in BKB form, but again, that change coming into fruition, Cinder, but it doesn't matter. Yawar's right clicks are too much to withstand, but he dies shortly after anyway. Alone drops next and Devi, well, he's got two assists, so it's not going to be the 007. Nice bramble blindly there. It's going to be a seventh death, though, nonetheless. That was honestly Triple pretty kill. admirable from Wildcard, right? They have a dead DP. Yeah. They still go for a four-man smoke. They burst Dragon Knight. They use that troll. Dude, that's a lost Roche. I think without this spell, they can't contest the pit. So I think Quincy, or I'm going to keep saying that once in a while because of their logo. It's It'll get fixed, I'm sure. Sonics will... That's going to be their reward for making it to move. TI. And their yeah. logo will be updated. It's going to have a team fight here. Alone gets crushed. Marcy is next. 
And the, well, actually, Eve ends up getting the kill onto Yawar, but now he's completely out of mana and now out of HP as Quinn is the real carry for Quincy Crew. Sammy Boy, he is likely to fall next, although there was a buyback from the Marcy, so you gotta be a bit careful. Pops the Unleash, using that to try to take out the Tombstone, but instead we'll take a split Earth to the face instead. But Alex actually able to rebound out to safety. Sammy Boy dies, though, to the hands of the Lesh as alone is going to get right click down. That's a dieback for him. And I would expect the GG's potentially. I think in this lane, I don't think they'll have time to wait three minutes before the top fight happens. So you might as well have chosen to fight for this one instead of waiting for top. Oh, the Vilam is going to get caught here. They might throw him uh, away. They will. Maybe there's an item they're waiting for, or they're just waiting for the dragon form to wear off. It is getting somewhat low, but the Vilam is dead right off the bat. Alex is next. Eve TP's in, and he's already at half HP. Might have to pop that ult. It's soul ripped, getting chased now by Quinn, and there's the BKB and the troll ult. Can't control your hero anymore, but this is on an Aegis target, so Quinn doesn't really care too much about dying He's not here. even dying. And he doesn't even die to begin with. That Bloodstone, pretty damn good. GG's finally come out, putting Sonic's up 1-0 in this series. A Gaben's top hat shellacking from minute six and beyond. They got absolutely crushed completely. And I mean, we, we had plenty of time during the game to talk over it, but I think the essential primary problem for all...